This is the PulseCore R6.5 cardiovascular monitor. Let's take a look inside the box and see what we find. So here is the device itself, and it also comes with batteries, power supply. This is a medical grade international uh, power supply. It comes with a number of different blade sets, and we'll choose the one that is suitable for use here. We can plug that in into the side of the device and the switch is also on the side so we can stand, uh, turn that on. The device has a stand on the back so we can stand that up. While it boots up it does a power on self test to make sure everything's okay and we'll get out the cuff. It comes with a range of cuffs, in this case we'll be using the adult cuff also a extension hose. So the extension hose plugs into the device. You can plug the cuff into the extension hose and then the cuff goes on to uh, my arm just like a normal blood pressure cuff. Open this up and pull that up onto my arm. Now we can take a measurement and to do that all we have to do is to press, press the green button. So it takes a measurement just like a normal blood pressure machine. It will inflate the cuff and then deflate and after that it takes another, me another measurement which we call suprasystolic. So we'll reinflate the cuff to around 30 millimeters mercury above systolic pressure and hold that for around 12 seconds. During that time it's listening for echoes within my arterial system. Every time my heart beats I have a pressure pulse that comes out of my heart and into the cuff. I also have one that comes out of my heart, goes down into the rest of my body via my aorta and bounces back up and into my arm. And if my arteries are stiff, that echo will come back faster and it will come back louder. And that is what the device is listening for right now. Okay, so the measurement has now completed. I can take this cuff off. It's measured my blood pressure at 128 over 90. My pulse rate is 77. You can see down here the rhythm strip, which gives each individual heartbeat. And it also calculates an average waveform, which is the, the shape in yellow. It calculates augmentation index of 50%. That's a peripheral augmentation index. And you can see the incident wave here, which is the wave directly into my arm, and also the reflection wave, which is that uh, little indentation buried in the side of the instant wave. So apart from all of that it also calculates a number of other parameters which we can see here uh, including a signal to noise ratio which gives you an indication of how clean the signal is. In this case 13.7 percent in green means very good. All of those parameters are available uh, and including the waveform to be logged to a computer via the serial port on the side or a serial to USB adapter. So that is the PulseCore R6.5 monitor. It is, as you can see, very simple to use.